Welcome back to hour two of our coverage of the 2010 Massachusetts gubernatorial election. The polls are only one hour from closing, and soon we're going to have an exclusive interview with the incumbent governor, Blake Stencil. But first, we're going to go to Craig Credence, who's going to give us a visual update on the polls. Craig? Thank you, Pete. As you can see by this election map, you notice that most of the polls here are actually quite... I'm, I'm sorry, Craig, I don't mean to interrupt, but is that a map of the state of Massachusetts drawn on a napkin? Yes, Pete, it is. This is indeed a napkin from Arby's that I poorly drew on. I was having a late dinner at Arby's last night when I totally realized that I had no preparations for this coverage whatsoever. Upon conclusion, I stole a napkin from Arby's and drew on it very quickly and very, very hastily. What were you even... Okay, just, just, just finish your report. Gladly, Pete. As you can see on this map, in the top right hand corner, there is a spot of red while the rest of the map is green and black. To be quite honest, I don't know what this is. That spot of red could be a ketchup stain, it could be just a dot of red marker, or it could be blood from my own finger from when I got a paper cut here on my way here. And, oh, yes, yes, I'm, I'm getting something, hold on. Yes, I have just been confirmed that this is not even a good representation of Massachusetts. In fact, it is only a poorly proportioned rectangle with green and red dots. And it is also reversible. I botched this one up. Back to you, Pete. 